Previously on Infra, Mark drank some hippie brew and then found himself at an abandoned train station. should get me closer to the office. Oh good, something more familiar. Although... I'm not sure how to get there, but... It'd probably help if you turn the power back on. Someone should get that fixed. Yeah. You do not want to be in there when the power comes back on. Because if it comes back on and you're in there, it'd be outright leave. Although seeing as it's not on now, it would be safe for you to go through. Well, you'd need to in order to turn the power back on. Well, I assume that the generator is somewhere around here. Well, that way is clearly locked, so... This way is clearly the way to go. Yeah, it doesn't look like there's anything for you to take pictures of. The other side. Good. Still eight packs of batteries left. Can't carry any more of this. Uh -huh. Yeah. Uh, Mark, yeah, that's where the generator is, and just need to find where to turn it on. Ah, there. And as suspected, going in there when the power is on. And this is the way back, and... Ah. Yeah, you might want to turn the power back off long enough for you to get that... ...wooden board. Well, that long bit of wood to allow you to get across. Because I can't see any other way of getting across otherwise. And then the rest of what you need to do is... Well, in that room you were just in. Yeah, it would work better if the narrow end is facing the doorway.
I still have nine packs of batteries left. Seven packs of batteries left. I'm guessing this place was flooded and needed to... make it much less wet. We know what we need to do here. Well, what you need to do. Go on another ride on one of those. Well, they're certainly more reliable than elevators, aren't they? Okay, once you're done searching around this office. Makes eight packs of flashlight batteries. Yeah, you're using a lot of them around here. Well, it is evening, so that's understandable, isn't it? Um, right. Yeah. 
I'm thinking. You're going the wrong way. And you're going the slow way. doing here? Surveying the tunnel. In case Pretty sure see. this is the wrong way. Yeah. Well, this wasn't here last time. Yeah, obviously. A cave-in isn't supposed to be there. And wasn't there last time. I mean, if cave-ins are normal the way you are. <sighs> Whoever's in charge of keeping on top of them is clearly doing a terrible job. Although, by the standards of Starbucks, probably pretty average. In which case, you excel as ever. Despite your practically teetotal. This is my stop. Door. I'm pretty sure that's not meant to be like that. Yeah, you're definitely coming into the building now. Well, walking anyway. a memo, or did they turn the parking garage into a swimming pool? Well, unless they've developed a taste for water polo, or water ballet, or anything that involves swimming. Seven packs of batteries left. I highly doubt that. But at least, I remember this. Now you just need to find your co-workers and your boss. <sighs> and let's hope they haven't turned into an anthropomorphic raccoon. Or Shisu's. Ah, there they are. I see they decided to meet up here. Well, might as well. Let's go down there and fill them in. Or rather, let them fill you in. Ugh, good. Mark is here. I'm so glad you're okay, buddy. I knew that Mark was going to make it. Mark, you're alive. I thought that something had happened to you. I even sent a rescue team looking for you. Where have you been? Hey, but I'm surprised that I'm still alive. It's a damn long story. You can tell me everything when we have time, but right now we have some big problems. I know that it's been a rough day, but we really need your help, Mark. What's going on? We just got word that the two gorgeous dam has collapsed. They're evacuating the city as we speak. It gets worse. We worried about the Stahlberg nuclear power plant. It was never built to handle a flood of this magnitude. We were waiting for a helicopter to take us there. But now that you're here, I think you should take the car. It's not a long drive, 
and you'll be there before us. Can't I just wait for the helicopter? We don't have the time. It's going to be a while until it gets here, and we need someone there as soon as possible. Fine. Yeah. And oh, I almost forgot. We had a bunch of new flashlights come in this morning, but I never got the chance to give one to you. There should be one on a table somewhere around here. <sighs> About time we had a new flashlight. And nuclear power plants! Yeah, it's just got worse. Because if that starts to fail, I'm thinking... <sighs> you should also take a radio with you. Can't use phones while the power is out. The battery on that flashlight should last for a few days. Another thing is that you can hold down the button to temporarily boost the light. Sweet. I don't suppose you have a new camera for me. Is there something wrong with your old one? <laughs> well, yeah. The battery's barely lasts for more than a few minutes. I'm afraid you'll have to use that one. We don't have any new ones. Anyway, good luck at the power plant. You can leave as soon as you're ready. We'll be joining you soon. Well, at least you don't have to worry about lighting. But as I was saying, if that power plant fails and... Well, let's just say that... Chernobyl will be... Will likely be considered miles by comparison. I mean, considering what we've already been through. But at least lighting is no longer a problem, so we can be thankful for small mercies. Yeah, I'm thinking the car is where you'd expect it to be. In the flooded garage. Yeah, phones being unreliable. No wonder you can call the office. Yeah, my advice. Head for your pickup truck and... See if you can drive to the nuclear power plant, if you can. But if you can't, as far as you can get to it. Yeah, probably had a lot of overtime pay after all this. Well, certainly enough for this day. for that, or they might at least give you the day off. After everything you've been through. Ah. Yeah, there it is. Here we go again. Guess I'll walk the rest of the way. Faster than turning back, anyway. That's not good. Turning back... That's not really an option, is it? because there's a nuclear disaster imminent and 
I don't think you can outrun that, can you? Border inspection? What is this? Oh, yes. It's a building full of conspiracy nuts. I think that can wait. Why not look into what's beyond this road? Considering the lights, I don't think you got far from the Stahlberg. Well, not the city, anyway. And being out here is better than being in a rapidly collapsing city. Alex Hartman might have been driven mad by the loss of his family. It wasn't a matter of if everything would fall apart, it was a matter of when. Well, they're not here now, so I look around, see what you can find, and <sighs> well, leave before they come back. already.
sure those keys will come in handy. And I suspect that will be needed in order to, well, get out of here. Nice to have nine packs of batteries left. <laughs> 